On July 11th, the telescope stunned scientists with its crystal clear images and intriguing discoveries. Among these revelations is the detection of an exoplanet boasting conditions conducive to supporting life. Additionally, it provided an image that covers 1 slash 5 the, the diameter of the Moon, offering an unprecedented view of Jupiter's rings. But what story does this James Webb Space Telescope image tell? And how might it revolutionise our understanding of the cosmos? Stick around to uncover all the fascinating details about this groundbreaking revelation. You can subscribe to the Cosmic Discovery Channel to watch videos related to the universe. We bring you the latest information about events happening in the cosmos first. So, be sure to hit the red button and subscribe the James Webb Space Telescope offers several advantages over the Hubble Telescope. Firstly, the JWST is positioned approximately 1.5 million kilometres away from Earth, which is four times farther than the Moon. This extended distance ensures that there is minimal interference from space stations or satellites that could potentially disrupt the telescope's observations. In comparison, the Hubble telescope orbits just 547 kilometres above Earth's surface and primarily observes in the visible and ultraviolet bands. Moreover, the JWST is equipped with advanced instruments such as NEOCAM for near-infrared and MIRI for mid-infrared spectrum capabilities that the Hubble lacks. This enhanced instrumentation significantly boosts the JWST's observational power, allowing it to detect even minute objects like a bumblebee fluttering in space at the distance between Earth and the Moon. Additionally, the JWST's infrared capabilities enable it to peer into the distant reaches of the universe, uncovering galaxies and older stars that might otherwise remain unseen. In contrast, the Hubble telescope faces limitations in its ability to penetrate the veils of gas and dust surrounding celestial bodies, hindering its ability to observe certain regions effectively. The James Webb Space Telescope effortlessly accomplishes this task, almost as if it possesses an X-ray beam. A key distinction lies in the size of the JWST mirror measuring 6.5 metres in diameter, enabling it to capture significantly more light compared to Hubble. In fact, this mirror stands as the largest ever deployed in space, nearly three times larger than Hubble's 2.5 metre mirror. Thanks to this innovative technology, the initial images obtained by the James Webb Telescope were remarkably clear, revealing even the faintest luminous objects. Notably, the James Webb achieved a groundbreaking feat by capturing the deepest and sharpest image of the early universe within a single day, a task that took Hubble several weeks to accomplish with similar clarity. The deep field image acquired by the James Webb showcases thousands of galaxies, underscoring its unparalleled capability in space exploration. Positioned at the image's core is a cluster of galaxies known as SMX0723, whose combined mass functions as a gravitational lens. This lensing effect bends light from more distant galaxies positioned behind it, resulting in a striking warp in the observed image. The James Webb Telescope has unveiled numerous galaxies previously unseen by other telescopes, marking a significant advancement in astronomical exploration. Initially focusing on our solar system, the telescope captured stunning images of Jupiter during its testing phase. Since then, it has continued to impress with its ability to capture Jupiter's intricate details. These images vividly showcase the planet's iconic stripes, a result of complex atmospheric phenomena, along with the immense Great Red Spot, spanning a colossal 16,000 kilometres and capable of engulfing the entire Earth. Additionally, Jupiter's moon Europa and other satellites are visible in the images. The James Webb Telescope achieved a remarkable feat by capturing images of Jupiter's rings, a challenging task given their faintness and the bright backdrop of space. Subsequently, the telescope shifted its focus to the distant exoplanet WASP-96b, situated far from our solar system, yielding surprising and intriguing results. Researchers have determined that WASP-96b is a gas giant with a mass less than half that of Jupiter, but a diameter 12 times larger. 
Remarkably, the exoplanet's composition renders it as puffy as cotton candy, orbiting its star much closer than Mercury does to the Sun, resulting in temperatures exceeding 1,000 degrees Celsius. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, detected the presence of clouds and haze in the planet's atmosphere, along with traces of water indicated by specific gas molecules. Scientists greeted this discovery with enthusiasm, particularly considering the Hubble Space Telescope's two-decade quest for water, culminating in its detection in 2013. While intriguing, this revelation pales in comparison to the potential discovery of extraterrestrial life forms on WASP-96b. Identifying biologically significant compounds like water, oxygen, carbon dioxide and methane represents an initial stride along this promising avenue. Should these substances be found on rocky planets, it would serve as a compelling indication to commence the search for signs of life there. Another captivating image captured by the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, reveals the Sour Drink Nebula, situated 2,500 light-years away from Earth. This nebula encircles a dying star and comprises at least eight layers of gas and dust expelled by the star. The central star's intense emissions blend these layers to form intricate structures akin to planetary nebulas, reminiscent of how sunlight penetrates gaps in clouds on Earth. Previously, the Hubble telescope had provided striking images of the Sour Drink and numerous other nebulas, revealing them to be intricate and colourful systems rather than mere gas clouds. However, the JWST has surpassed this by offering an even more intricate image of the planetary nebula, along with a broader view of the space beyond it teeming with galaxies. In comparison to the Hubble image, the James Webb image exhibits much greater detail, with the bright stars displaying six points of light instead of four. This disparity arises from the optical configurations of the two telescopes. Hubble's round lenses feature a secondary mirror suspended in front of them in four extensions, whereas the JWST's lens consists of 18 hexagonal mirror segments. Now, behold the breathtaking portrayal of the purple Milron, depicting the spiral galaxy NGC 628, also recognised as M74, nestled in the constellation Pisces, approximately 32 million light-years away from our planet. What sets this image apart from the Hubble rendition of the same galaxy? The distinction lies in the James Webb Telescope's distinct mission conducting an intricate analysis of the veils of dust and gas obstructing light from most stars. This endeavour enables us to witness the aftermath of supernova explosions and the process of star formation, rendering the image more dynamic. But let's delve further. Let's explore another remarkable image. It's the JWST's monumental capture, spanning approximately the diameter of the Moon. This image showcases Stefan's Quintet, a compact group of galaxies nestled in the constellation Pegasus, situated about 290 million light-years away from our vantage point. The portrayal of Stefan's Quintet by the illustrious James Webb Telescope unveils a mesmerizing spectacle. Four of the five galaxies engaging in an enthralling gravitational dance as they approach and collide, while the fifth galaxy observes from a distance of 40 million light-years from Earth. Although the Hubble telescope has previously offered glimpses of Stefan's quintet, the James Webb image unveils unprecedented detail, meticulously crafted from nearly 1,000 distinct images, totaling over 150 million pixels. The image uncovers radiant patches of distant galaxies in the backdrop, alongside expansive zones of star formation and expansive trails of gas, dust and stars expelled from various galaxies due to gravitational interactions. Additionally, colossal shockwaves are discernible as the galaxy NGC 738b traverses the cluster. Within the galaxy, NGC 7319 lies an active supermassive black hole at its nucleus, and the James Webb Telescope managed to peer beyond the dense shroud of gas and dust encasing the galaxy's core. The telescope meticulously detected hot gas near the black hole, 
offering profound insight. Moreover, the depiction of the cosmic clips unveiled a burgeoning star-forming domain dubbed NGC 3324 within the Carina Nebula. The relentless ultraviolet radiance and stellar winds from exceedingly massive young stars have intricately sculpted the nebula's wall. Yet again, experts found themselves taken aback when juxtaposing the images captured by the Hubble and James Webb telescopes. Notably, the image produced by the JWST exudes remarkable clarity, notably apparent upon overlaying the images from both telescopes. Within the image, one can discern luminous spots in the background, encompassing not only stars, but also exceedingly distant galaxies. The azure haze seemingly emanating from the Chesto Mountains actually comprises hot ionized gas and dust expelled from the nebula by the incessant radiation emitted by the youthful stars. Thank you for joining us on this cosmic journey. If you enjoyed exploring the wonders of the universe with us, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more captivating content. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Which discovery fascinated you the most? We'd love to hear from you. Stay tuned for our next adventure as we continue to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. Remember to hit the like button if you found this video enlightening. Until next time, keep looking up!